hello everyone and welcome back to another video and in this video I'll be showing you how to do cool stuff in Google Hangouts like commands or whatever this is Google Hangouts on the computer it just uh, the window is larger so yeah you just have to make it larger you just have to drag the edges so every single command or whatever I'm going to show you is going to be visible by everyone on the hangout when you do it except for the Konami code to reset any effects, just close out of the Hangout, then go back in. The first one is slash pitchforks. You type it in like that. Press enter. And pitchforks will come in from the side. So in order to get more pitchforks going, just type in this more times. I'm using copy paste, by the way. And a larger wave of pitchforks will come. This one is slash bike shed. Type in like that, press enter, and the whole hangout will change a different color. So, um, for any person um, on the hangout, it's gonna be a different color. For example, it's green right now. For a different person on the hangout, it might turn out to be yellow. So it's not always reliable like that. But you can also change it to rainbow colors, which is cool. Oh, for some reason, it's... Okay, that's better. Um, it was changing between only two colors. I think it changes into a random color every time you do it. This one is called the Shy Dino. Just do slash Shy Dino. Then press enter. It'll stay there forever, so you have to do it again. And it's gone. What? This one is slash ponies. Just type it in like that. Press enter. And a single pony will come in. But in order to get more ponies, you use slash pony stream. This is slash pony stream. It'll send an endless wave of ponies from both sides. And the only way to get rid of it is to do it again. It might take a while because the hangout is so big. I made the hangout bigger, so it just takes longer. This is the only one that will not be visible by other people on the hangout. It's the Konami code, so up, up, down, down, left, right, left, right, B, A, enter. And it changes to this. Um, it looks a bit stretched because my hangout is larger. Okay, so this one's pretty weird. It's slash roll. Like that, press enter, that'll pop up. However, it's different from regular messages because regular messages are like that, but this is slash roll. This one is sort of like slash roll. It's, it's slash me, but it does not have the roll the die part. It just makes your name. But you can type anything you want after it. So slash me, I'm gonna put a colon and I can say, hi, hi. So it's pretty neat. Slash lit. Is a regular message makes three flames. Slash that is a regular message. It does this. Slash happy is also a regular message and it does this. Oh, uh, the one on the bottom is slash happy. Slash table back is a regular message and it does that, the one on the bottom. Slash puppy party is a regular message. And it does that, the one at the bottom. Doing the following emotes will create hangout emotes. Smile. Sad. Oh yeah, just saying smile and sad are colon, then parenthesis, if you didn't know. This one is wink, it's semicolon, then parenthesis. This one is cat face, semicolon, not sorry, colon three. Another cool thing you can do is have multiple hangouts open and spam slash pitchforks into all of them, like copy paste it. Oh, well that one just ended, but it looks like they're running from tab to tab. Also effects overlap, as you can see I have Konami code, bike shed, pony stream, pitchforks, 
and Shy Dino all in the same hangout, so they overlap. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe. Hope you learned some cool things in Hangout, and bye.